fonts. Now there are other places to get fonts, but this is all free. Like fonts cost money. They can cost thousands of dollars. What? Yeah, believe it or not. So to get the, like a right font, the Google has thousands of free fonts that you can choose from. And you can kind of just scroll endlessly on this thing to find a good font. Now I'm making, we're, in this class we've been doing a shoe website. So we got something kind of modern, something cool. So we just kind of have to go through here and see if there's anything that we'd like. So if anyone sees a font that seems like modern and cool and hip. This, that is not modern and cool. Like I said, there's thousands. Let's go through this a little. You like this? <coughs> this? All right, great. So we'll do this one. Now this is very simple, all right? To change the font, all you have to do is go to get font. All right, we're gonna get the embed code. Okay, I'm just gonna. Then over here, you see all this link stuff? This goes in the head of your project. Remember, the head is where you like do all the background work. So you're actually downloading the font. So I'm gonna come over here, inside of the head, right under the other link, I'm gonna add the links. So you see how I already had a link here? You're gonna add the rest of the links inside of the head tags. So that doesn't add it yet though. You just downloaded it into your project. The next part is to use it. So over here, let's go over here. Okay. I'm going to grab this, come back over here, style that CSS. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to change all of it. So in body, I'm going to say I want this font. Okay. See where it says font family, Jost? That's the one we downloaded. See where it says, where is it? Jost is the name of this one. So that should change all the fonts. And if you look here, you see now my website looking a lot cooler now that I have this new cool font that Clarence picked out for us. All right, so it's a requirement. Like I said, your websites will look terrible if you use like New York Times New Roman, which is the default. So make sure you check out a font on Google Fonts, add it in, watch the video if you don't know how to do this. All right, you gotta add link, you gotta add the CSS, and then you're good to go. All right, so today's the last day in class to work on this. Monday you come in, you present your projects. Please make, remember to check the rubric to see how you're graded. Remember you're gonna grade your partners, that's part of it. Um, yeah, get started. I'm here to help with whatever you need. Get going, guys. 